in dry spell news. The pussy oh. dry. Oh, you think it has to do with sex, huh? Uh, you fuck a freak? Oh. oh, look at that, trying to be cute. Submitted by... There's a spider. <laughs> bruised banana. Oh, kill that fire. Oh my god, that's It fire. came from the, from the, the lens. lens. Camera lens, yeah. So if you guys saw something blurry, it was just a spider. Pick that motherfucker up. It's just living. It's going. Oh, it's a baby spider. Anyway, continue. Yeah, I'm about to kill that motherfucker. Uh, I'm about to throw it. Oh, it'll be dead. Like that. <laughs> I'll crush him into oblivion. Like this. Yeah. Oblivion. <laughs> Here are six things that happen to men's bodies when they don't have sex for a while. I need to know this. What? Why do you need to know? Yeah, because why? I never get sex. You never How get about sex? if I jack off? Oh, that's different than yeah, that. I be having sex all the time. Yeah, it's jacking off? <laughs> yeah, is it actually six things that happen to men's body if they don't ejaculate? Um, Probably. And is blue ball syndrome real? Or you need to feel the warmth of a woman's bosom. <laughs> or pussyum. Pussum. A pussum. Pussum. <laughs> pussum. I think masturbating um, is off the table. I it think counts, it also counts. Of course, yeah, it's, it's okay. the ejaculation thing. Okay, number one, your rhythm gets thrown off the next time you have sex. So, what do I you know do? that old expression, if you don't use it, you lose it? So science suggests that to a degree that might be true. And so there was a study back in 2008 uh, in the American Journal of Medicine, and it concluded that men in their 50s, 60s, and 70s that weren't sexually active were more likely to suffer from erectile dysfunction. And so, oh. and so they're saying that, um, you know, if there's a while that you don't go with, uh, if you don't have sex for a while, then you're just, your entire body kind of forgets a little bit how sex works and then it's, you struggle. Oh, it's the opposite for me. If I haven't gone for a while, then I ejaculate pretty quick the next time, and I'm like, oh, maybe it's crap. for older guys. <laughs> it might be like ten years of like yeah, not yeah. jacking off or touching it even or whatever, because yeah. that's like having a dead ass arm. <laughs> like, if I don't fucking move this motherfucker for like thirty years, it's gonna be very skinny and not useful. But it's you like, said thirty years, man. Like, is this thirty years? They don't specify. No, but it's like when you, if you stop playing the guitar, all of a sudden you get rusty. I think like, you're yeah, still young, so you still got a lot of testosterone, but if you're like 50 or 60, if you're not activated as testosterone, yeah. then it's probably going to go away. So then this is only talking about Boner Town. That's what I see. Well, this, that? Was, this is published on menshealth.com. <gasps> I read this thing on Men's Health not too long ago where a dude was trying to figure out what would happen to you if you don't masturbate. And that motherfucker said, I'm going to do this and I'm going to try this out. That bitch lasted three days. <laughs> he was like, I can't, I can't do it. Who said that? It was this dude on Men's Health Men's or something. Health it was like an article. Oh. There's a uh, no jack challenge. Oh, no, no nut November. Is it? Is yeah. that what it is? So it was no shave November and then no, no nut. nut so you get a big ass beard and you just, you can't. You just have a lot of cum. Well, maybe that's why, why it's no nut know? because you're not going to get any pussy <laughs> at your home. Yeah, all this scruff. Yeah, it's yeah, supposed to be scruffy. no nut November. That's the thing. I failed both ways because I can't grow a beard and I already <laughs> jacked off plenty of times and did it. So. Oh, yeah, we are in November. I keep forgetting that. Yeah, so. Number two. <laughs> Checklist out the door. <laughs> if you don't masturbate, your risk of prostate cancer goes up. I heard about oh. that one. I heard about that one. Why? Because it's for the health. But what if you masturbate too much? I'm not sure about too much, but they are saying that. And what is too much? I think it's cool because you're unclogging the pipes. Yeah. Yeah, so they're saying that. Um, a bunch of dead shit in the pipes, right? That you gotta just expel. So they have, they're saying that there have been multiple studies that have pointed to the conclusion that high ejaculation frequency which is about uh, 4.6 to 7 times a week is linked to lower, yeah, it's linked to lower prostate cancer. Who has time other than fucking teenagers and like fucking young kids to do it that often? You could jack off every day. You could jack off every day. Really? Yeah. A week, a week. Yeah, you just wake up in the morning, right in the shower, just knock it out. Yeah, wake up in the morning and go into the shower and make it out of time. <laughs> I take a look in at a book and then I take, the, take my dick out and then, 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 then it's like, okay. Hey, what's your guys' records when you guys were teenagers for like in a day? You have track? Do you have like a track record? No, I mean like, like no, in a day, like when you were just bored. You oh, just like, how man. many times I remember the like, record, but I've probably done it more than five times. Damn! I'm, I'm lower than that. Yeah. I think I was like four and I was like, it doesn't, nothing else happening anymore. Like, Dude. I can't do anymore. I've never, uh, I've never done it that way. I profusely mastered Probably like somewhere between 16 and 19. I was, I remember I was still living in my dad's house. And I think I was just really that bored. And it was yeah. to the point where it hurts. Yeah, yeah, it hurts. I yeah. still can't, I don't know why. I guess I have nothing else to do. So I'm just going to jack off once again. And then I feel like guilty and shameful that I did that when it's already hurting and it's just clear liquid coming out at this point. But I was like, 
one more time. Has it ever happened where you jerk off and you feel like you ejaculated, but then nothing comes out? Yeah. What? Wait, what? Yeah. Like, like you ejaculate, nothing comes out? Yeah. Yeah. No. You don't. Well, you don't ejaculate. You, just like, nothing you, comes you out. Like, or I guess at that point, it'll do the. Saying, it'll do. You're talking about it'll do the. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, that's, that's what happened. Yeah, yeah, yeah. On like the seventh off, time? Yeah. I'm going off of, yeah, off of what you're saying, yeah, yeah, where it's like yeah, clear yeah. liquid to this point. But it's just, oh. <laughs> it, I mean, still a little bit comes out, but it's like nothing. It's like pre-cum amounts. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I've never jacked off that much, though. I jacked off like it was a fucking Olympic sport, dude. <laughs> I trained for that shit, because I was preparing for the future. I said to myself, I need to be able to last long for the woman of my dreams. Right. Cause I, I gotta, Doesn't yeah. That shit fucking hurt though? It, it's hurting and it's throbbing. And like it back to off. back to back or like just in a day? In a just in a day, not back to back to back, but just in a And day. there was a very healthy supply of porn and the supply just didn't meet demand or the demand, yeah, the demand, yeah. no, there was supply. <laughs> yes, we get, we get <laughs> economics, <laughs> we get how economics works. Yes, yeah, Fuckonomics, we understand fuckonomics. There was too many. Cause I was already like, fuck, when can I recharge to watch the next one? Because there's just too many in the library. Have you guys ever tried this? So you know, like for most guys, uh, after you come, it's really sensitive and you can't touch it again. And it's like, uh, like a wilted flower. Have you guys ever right after go, fuck that, I'm gonna wake your ass up and try to- make Just slapping him. Hey, yeah. hey. Come back hard again. Yeah, 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 I've done it before. Sometimes you can keep it, you know, if you try hard enough. If you do it, there's a there's a window of like a minute, and yep. if you can like keep it hard, you can. Keep I it swear, you have time. a fucking journal, huh? <laughs> no, I just I got a good memory. Don't lie. Very, very you look like you have a fucking journal. But I did masturbate at a very very young age, so like it was kind of weird for me because when I was younger, I used to do it, but then nothing came out because I was like, yeah, me six. too. But then yeah. one, one yeah. what the fuck? Yeah. Oh no, I was, I was like, pretty young. I got I exposed like, to like that HBO fake porn thing yeah. where it was like softcore where you can see anything. Thing, but you knew something was going on. Yeah. Um, so at age 12, I think I was doing my thing and I was like, oh shit, what is this stuff coming out? And I was like, this is what my dad told me about. Like, this is how babies are made. And I was like, yeah. that means I can have like kids now. And I was like, I got how scared for like, that point? I think I was like 12 or 11. I was in middle yeah. school. I remember I was in middle school. Me too. And I freaked out the first time when I was like, no, it's real now. I remember that. <laughs> no, it was like clear liquid yeah. that was just coming out first or nothing at all. <laughs> My grandma had this like neck massaging thing. It was kind of like a scarf, but you you turn it on and it's like and it fucking massages your neck. That shit I wrapped around my fucking dick and turned it on, and that was the best. And I don't know why. I just, Wait, you I, were like, and then your you grandma were, took your bag and put it back around her neck. I didn't even know what I was doing, but that shit was soaked in my fucking like not even ready cum juice, and I was like fucking around with it, and I didn't know what I was doing. It just felt good. Your grandma used that, you bastard! Did you give it back to her? It smells yeah. like bleach again! Did like you that? clean it at least? No, I was fucking fourth grade, fifth grade. I don't, yeah, you don't know, think about cleaning it. You just like. Oh, yeah. uh, that's like Isaac's age and stuff. Uh, yeah. 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 We're using a black light in Isaac's room. That is gonna be come on all his toys. You should. That'd be an awesome fucking YouTube video. Fuck no. That'd be an awesome vlog. Trippin, wait till Tyga. You can awesome not, vlog. I'm not thinking of Tyga, I'm thinking of Isaac. No, no, no. Tyga. Tyga's jerking off now. I'll do it. He's I'll jerking off while you're, you're, you're here. That's kind of cute. <laughs> Come on. Whee! All right, point number three, because he can't control his hands. He's like trying really hard. Little carrot fingers. Fuck. He's just, he's just, he's just scrunching it up. <laughs> so number three out of six. Like this. Here we go. Fuck <laughs> you. Uh. Number three, your blood pressure can spike if you stop having sex for a little while. Oh, for oh, real? So angry all the time. Well, they're saying that because um, you're stressed. Yeah. Yeah, so they were saying that in a 2006 study in the medical journal of uh, biological psychology, they found that people who were having regular sex had lower levels of blood pressure than those. What's regular sex? I don't know. Okay. No, right? I, I, that might all be like subjective. I know. What it's true. Like I don't feel like I think they're saying like regular, like just like to you. constantly. Oh. I mean, whether weekly, monthly, whatever, but if you're on some sort of. Pattern. Fuck schedule? Yeah, fuck schedule. <laughs> <laughs> all right, number four. If you don't have sex for a long time, you will get more stressed out. Yeah. Yeah. Of so course. I don't think I need to explain it. I think that's yeah. er everybody. Yeah. Yep. Next one, number five, your immune system gets weaker. Why? Oh, shit. Mm -hmm. So they are saying that there was a study where they asked patients who were having sex once or twice a week to provide saliva samples. Those samples were found to contain an extremely high concentration of the common cold busting antibody immunoglobulin. So, globulin or whatever. Yeah, globulin A. Uh, and so they're just saying that it helps you um, 
fight off the cold. Have a better immune system. Oh, yeah. no wonder I got sick. So, Thanks a lot, Gio. Look at him now. He never wants it. You didn't give me enough blowjobs. <laughs> I, I tried need, so I need hard. immunity blowjobs. I tried so hard. You just have to take it from him. Yeah. Take what from him? Do you have to take? I'll take his dick from him. Yeah, it's good for me. I do, but look at how big he is. That's why he trains so hard, so I can't freaking take advantage of him anymore. Doesn't matter how big he a guy stops you. Is. Fucking stop! <laughs> It doesn't matter how big a guy is, you tickle his balls, he'll melt. Yep. And the fucking tree of life grows. <laughs> <laughs> the tree of life. Yeah, and so the last point here, number six, your work performance might slip. Mm, of course. So, yeah. Do you, do you That's it? That's all you got? <laughs> huh? Because all stress, everything's related to one thing. Stress, 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 stress. Once you relieve the stress. Oh, and also your work performance goes lower because when a guy comes, he comes to his senses. It's true. Yeah. That's actually very yeah, true. Right. That's right. After you come, you fucking come in the girl's face. She's like, why did I do that to you? That's yeah, disgusting. Yeah, yeah. You're like, oh, that was That's the worst. Terrible. I should you have never done it. So, you guys are fucking animals. Because after you come, I can see exactly clearly yeah. yeah. the rain is gone. That song plays in your head. I know, but you guys are like Neanderthals. Like, you guys are like. <laughs> we are, though. We're homo sapiens. We're literally animals. I don't get all scientific We're and shit, a primate. please. I'm just trying to make a point. How What's you guys the point? Did, how you guys just didn't evolve the way women did. That's all. Yeah. What crazy? <laughs> No, it's not crazy, you there's guys, one taking care you guys of your You send out your yeah. fucking, what's it called, your pheromones and shit. Wait, what about it? Your pheromones, you what send it, it out. What about it? And that makes the guys go crazy, it's crazy juice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, if you guys didn't have crazy juice everywhere, it wouldn't be, wouldn't be like me. Yeah, it's not my fault, girls. Yeah. It's not my fault that girls got a nice butt. 